Team coverage continues now with 7 News reporter Amanda Koss. Amanda, you found a congregation rallying around their church, wiped out by floodwaters, and quite a pastor there. And you can see straight through the church library to the men and the, the you can hear the men. And you can see the debris that they are cleaning up behind me. Now, I want to talk to you really quickly about the efforts that they've gone through so quickly to put this church back together. We're walking from the church library into the pastor's office. And throughout this, they're saying that their focus is on what they still have, including these, these handwritten sermons from many years ago. I've been the pastor here for 35 years. Even for a man who preaches every Sunday, sometimes there are no words. People have showed up that I really don't know. The Bible Baptist Church of Erie. This is our main entryway. Flooded three times in three days. Thursday when it flooded, the water was, uh, it may have been about right in here on Thursday, but the Friday morning flood came up to here. 24 inches of unholy water. This is the main entrance into my auditorium. That water turned all my chairs over, floated everything, and these are heavy chairs, destroyed all my hymn books, my Bibles, and everything. A fitting title here on the bottom shelf in Pastor James Duncan's office. The test of life. <laughs> I tell you, there's just been so many things that just, uh, you know, uh, uh, just like that, the test of life. And again, Peter says the trial of our faith is much more precious than gold. Trials and tribulations, mud, mold, and murky water. Inspiration. Okay, Riley, here's some more. That was back to like that. Lifted up by the tiniest of helpers. So hard, and she had her little broom out there sweeping Saturday, and she's done the same thing today. She wants to help. I want to help the church. Their pastor. And I have said over and over and over, and and that the church is not this building. Practicing what he preaches. The church is the people in the heart and soul of people. And we can have church in this parking lot or in that building out there. It doesn't make any difference where we meet. And Jesus says, where two or three are gathered in my name, I'll be in the midst of them. Answering this test of faith with resolve. This is my heart and passion. I have no desire to do anything else. And you're looking at the baptistry, one of the many things they still need to clean up here at the church. Now here inside this main auditorium, you can see a lot of work has been done today. Pastor Duncan right there hugging one of the congregation members. They're praying during my live shot right now. They've come together, they are continuing to work, and Pastor Duncan says his goal is to be back at this pulpit preaching to his congregation in this building in two weeks. Reporting live in Erie, Amanda Cost, 7 News.